All right, round three, let's do it. <sighs> okay, oh God. Oh God, okay. Um. So I want a little bit of this. Do you even want Arcanine? Do you even want Rillaboom? I don't want Rillaboom. Urshifu seems okay. So then it's like Arcanine or Back Cinderace. I guess I'd prefer Arcanine. So I think I like just air slash into dust globs. Probably fake it out, but then I get to bruise the incinerator work pretty heavily. all these extra tabs that don't matter. Real of them. Okay. Well, I don't want my Primarina to just be parting shot the whole time. For that again, I'm going to do this. All right, I need to I need to focus. Ugh. I was looking at Discord messages and stuff, but this is going to be a long game. Yep. Oh, I was like, wow, they hit hard, but that makes sense. Okay, you have Trick Room and Rillaboom really up, now what? Um, not particularly scared of anything this Rillaboom really has to offer, so I'm gonna yawn this slot and burn this slot.
they have U-turn, that kind of sucks. If they have U-turn, enter faster. Oh wow, they're Willow Whisper too. Wait, this is... That was just like memes. Okay. This Pokemon is drowsy. This feels kind of free. Colossal. I might switch to Rillaboom, but I'm fine with that. Because then I get to follow me and then reset terrain. Yeah, I, I get to just spam follow me the whole time now. And Primarina should be able to sweep. going for it. <laughs> if my pre-marina had protect, I would consider double protecting here, but it doesn't, so I kind of just have to go for the KO, which ends up meaning that the yawn actually doesn't mean much, but I didn't really have a better play anyway, so it doesn't matter. And also... If I didn't yawn, like, it's conceivable, especially because, like, they didn't have to go for that bulldoze right there. Um, they could have just, like, nightshaded and bulldozed the next turn. And if I didn't yawn there, then um, they could just switch back out uh, to Rillaboom because they have a good matchup or whatever. G-Max Rock. Easy. They have Ensign, Rillaboom, and Dusclops. So I think we're good. Um... I should have been keeping track of how much Trick Room's left, because I might have actually... Let's see. Well, if we go for help, if, if the Trick Room's over, we're actually fine. Because we have Helping Hand, and we get to nuke the Clops, but I think we have one turn left, so... Ensign. So you're gonna parting shot into my prim. Fine. Yeah, one turn of trick room left, so 
we Helping Hand and Starfall into this? Because if they want a parting shot, then their Rillaboom's going to get a meaty hit. Do they not have Nightshade? Okay, let's see how much Rillaboom does against our Primarina. Grassy Glide. I feel like Primarina's dead. I guess I don't really care about this Dust Pops. So if I just will o -wisp this, we're fine. That's why. Okay. Reset terrain on your your butt. So now Dusclops literally can't do damage. Oh, I could bulldoze. That's it. So that's kind of like whatever. So now we just have to play around like. Yeah, I guess we just start spamming uh, Flare Blitz, huh? I mean, I kind of want to cycle Intimidates, but... I just don't know how to play against this Dust Clops because like it could really only ally switch, but then like it might just start clicking bulldoze. <laughs> I think we're in a good spot though. Like does this really boom KO even? I don't know. So like the snarl, the next snarl should KO also. Next snarl should do it, and I think we're just good. It doesn't even have pain split, so whatever. I think we just win.
misty terrain. Okay. Kind of silly. It's kind of a silly game. I don't think I switched my plan. I think my what I did actually covers all of their options too. I think the one thing I do is just actually let them get Trick Room up. I kind of don't care if they have Trick Room. Because I always reverse KO their Colossal, and then my Primarina is like just pretty fine against everything. So if they do the same lead or whatever, I just play differently. <laughs> I'm expecting them to lead uh, Rilla also, but. That's easy, I could air slash or uh, whatever. Like a Rillaboom lead is pretty abusable. I love this pan flute. Center or real, but okay, I kind of wasn't expecting that. Let's see, doesn't seem that strong though. What you gotta do? I kind of want to yawn, but I also kind of want to get air slashes off. I guess the air slash doesn't do much, but the yawn does. Let's take it slow. scared if they do that. Um, yeah, if I just burn this, it's whatever. Okay, whatever. <laughs> 
So if they swap in Colossal and I don't get the flinch, I'm in a pretty bad spot. But I feel it's just so easy for them to swap in Rillaboom if I go here. I'm gonna do this play. It might be kind of bad though. actually didn't see what they did. Okay, they did get Trick Room off. Oh, they have that too. Okay, maybe I made a mistake. Yeah, I think I made a mistake. See. All right, well, one Pokemon's gonna get KO'd. Huh. I should have Wicked Blood the Dust Clops. Ugh. I was too worried about this calc that like actually kind of doesn't matter. And I should have thought more that like, yeah, I could I could just wicked blow the dust gloves here. It doesn't it's, it doesn't have recovery. Such a better play. Yeah, this this close comment ain't doing enough. Who am I kidding? Yeah, that was a joke. Shouldn't have even brought in Urshifu to be honest. Primarina's fine at minus one because I'm KOing that Colossal regardless. Uh, I just kind of have to do this. Do I have to keep this around? I kind of need it for their instant. Could do this, it's kind of like a stalling mechanism. Yeah, I had to bring in, yeah. It's weird, because they parting shot the Primarina if I bring it in, but. On the other hand, it doesn't let them bring in Colossal, so then they bring in Rillaboom, and then I could just swap back out, because if they, if, 
they don't have if they have a gorilla boom and what you call it a uh, dust claps out i'm just not threatened at all and i could just stall out their trick room from there but when i bring in urshifu they're like okay yep it's colossal time and then i'm just out of position whereas if i'm slightly out oh my god uh, yeah uh -huh. Oh. Oh, why did I detect? The detect is so pointless. At least my Colossal's not doing a lot of damage. Oh wow, that did a lot more than I was expecting. That's why. I think the burn gets to it? Nope. Switch, I think. Grassy terrain is down. Urshifu's mind is overstuck. That's pretty funny. Um, I tried to call it ally switch and I didn't. Feels, feels ally switch. Ugh. That was just bad. Okay, um, how are we gonna beat game three? I guess to s figure out if it's actually special or physical, I think it's special. That's Max Quake, I don't know what Max Quake they use. Earth Power, okay, special. They get like Meteor Beam now? Okay. This is the conundrum I'm in right now. I want to bring in... It's like I almost want to bring in Cinderace, but 
Even if they just do instant Rilla Boom again, it's like I'm not great against Cinderace. But I kind of am, because I could just like start Nuffling. Although the moment they switch in one Mon to Dusclops, I'm pretty boned. The thing is, if they just go um, surf bolt, we just kind of kind of die. Uh, let's see. So yeah, what's going on is we could go Cinderace. Cinderace Togekiss is good against Rillaboom. Oh, they're instantly locking in. <sighs> I'm not gonna read too much into that. Um, so if they go instant Rillaboom. Let's see. How does Cinderace work here? They could go instant clops and we can't actually I'm gonna play it safe because like I think Cinderace is kinda bad. We just do the same thing again. And we just have to play a bit better. We we can't bring in Urshifu early. What happens if we KO the Rillaboom or Pre Marina actually just like 1v3s them? Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of in the same camp that I don't actually care if Trick Room gets up. And we know we could just hyper voice too, because they don't have pain split. Uh, Bro, I didn't care anyway. They crit it? No. It's gonna be my pro gamer move to play around taunt. And yeah, my, my stance here is I don't actually care if they uh, parting shot, because Primarino will still KO. Okay, yeah. Couldn't couldn't care less. Okay, so they, they didn't go for the taunt. It's interesting. So they bring in Rillaboom, but now it's like we yawn lock you. Is this a moment we could bring in Urshifu? Yeah, 
Urshifu here is interesting. I felt like I was just talking about how I can't bring in Urshifu. I'm trying to think what happens. I guess I like this because... If we threaten the Dusclops, the Colossal is not that threatening either. I'm also fine like just sacking a Pokemon just to get Primarina into the game. Okay, that's whatever. It's a lot of passive damage. Okay, you knock off the Citrus Berry, I don't really care. Then I'm just gonna start spamming Wicked Blow into your Dusclops slot, and you can't really do much. TBH. Y'all follow me here? I kinda like follow me on this turn. Yeah, I don't want my Urshifu to be burned. hit pretty hard. Not hard enough. Okay, what's the plan here? I don't hate Protectant to switch to Primarina. They could hard read that, but whatever. Yeah, so they could hard read the switch. If they do, then then I just am like really bad at VGC and I need to I need to go just ladder. I need I need to play a thousand ladder games if they just hard read the switch. It's not a crazy switch to hard read. It just, it means I'm bad and I put myself really out of position. It's, not, it's really not the craziest switch to read. But like on the other hand, I could be follow me plus close combat. And that's like, I think that KOs you. Oh, they did it. They really did it. I think they did. Okay, no, 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 no. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Does a lot of damage, but we get one follow me off. I think. Ow, oh, that hurt. Oh, we're gonna do a KO to the burn. Oh, damn it. It didn't really matter then, did it? Oh, that's... That's really big game. Okay. Wait, hold up now. Hold up now. Alright, so... Guess we play around ally switch now, huh? Okay, so can we? You go for trick room max guard or you could ally switch. 
Feels like a 50-50 to me. I like that. We could... Problem here is I just don't think I'll do enough damage. But I kind of like this play. I don't like this play, but I kind of like this play. Uh, this is actually bad versus max guard trick room. So I went for the hard read ally switch, but then I half asked it and I should have just wicked blowed. Ugh. This is so annoying to play against. Okay. Yeah, we, we just had to wicked blow. Like, yeah, this is. This was not a good play, but this worked out, so whatever. don't know their no it's knockoff okay so we only have to play around grassy glide uh where's our pre marina um, and then if it's minus one okay. yep, not plus one so it'll deal about 50 to 50 to 60 percent to our pre marina But they're bringing it in sin. Interesting choice. It's a really weird choice. Their incident was low. Wow, Wicked Blow on that Dust Class would have been great. Like last turn. Um, okay, well, we're not worried about Grassy Glide Cops right now, so I just need to not look at them. Every time I'm like, oh my god, crit, and then I realize, oh, it doesn't matter. So they get to swap in instant a few times, but we bring in Arcanine. I think we're good. I think we got this locked. into the clops, right? Okay. <sighs> Hopefully, we should live one turn. I need to get this grassy terrain off. Uh, this is actually... Prunes at 200. Okay, so we're... We're guaranteed to live. So we bring in Arcanine. We... Starfall the Ensign, I guess. Just because it's low. Yeah, oh, our Arcanine's at full. Okay, that's really good. Um, yeah, I guess we just Starfall here. We could Starfall here. I don't hate that just because I don't want to proc a berry, honestly. And I think they, 
I think they're Barry, and we just never propped it in the series. Yeah, yeah, because then we just close combat KO, and then Arcanine gets a Flare Blitz a million times. That does a lot, but not enough. It does an amount of damage. All right, nice. Oh, that's that's stressful. That was a stressful match. Is there pre marina live for like one health? Yeah, Thirteen. That's not even that bad. Um, yeah, I mean, Prince, dead meat, but whatever. I actually don't know what attack their Incineroar has. It's Parting Shot, Fake Out, and Taunt, and then what else? I don't think I've seen it use it, but Flare Blitz. It's probably Flare Blitz. Ugh. Stressful game, stressful game. This is like game three. Should go right. Alright. Let's go. I think I played this last game super well. No, not super well. I should have wicked blowed into the dust laps, but whatever. Like, uh, I like my macro. That, I mean, that's what I'm noticing. My macro is good. My macro game plans are good, but my, uh, I just always like blunder a turn here or there, which is just something I need to work on. Um, okay. That was round three. Yep. 